you guys, seriously, you probably would have walked past this, right? Hey, Bolo Buddies. Thanks for watching. All right, you guys, in this video, we're going to talk about big money bolos, items to be on the lookout for, items that you can hopefully buy low and sell for a profit on platforms like eBay, Poshmark, Mercari, Etsy, and other platforms. Um, really, the platform that we sell the items on doesn't mean you have to sell it on that platform. These items will sell on lots of platforms. So what am I doing here? I posted this in my Bolo Buddies Facebook group share your best April Bolo, share your best May Bolo is up right now. If you guys want to go share um, your Bolo, that would be fantastic. It's up under the announcements section of the group. Anyway, I'm going to tell you where they got the item, what they paid for it and what it sold for. And hopefully when you're out in the wild looking for items, you will be able to find one of these Bolos. So the first one here is probably something that most of you would have walked right past. Susan Bates Vintage Crochet Hooks, lot of nine, new old stock. Found a shoebox full of crochet hooks at a rummage sale for $1.50. There are nine new old stock, which sold for $88 in three days. Lotting up the loose ones definitely don't pass up vintage crochet hooks. Check it out. These were a dollar a piece when they were new. How fun is that? All right, let's look at the next one here. This one's interesting. Now, this is more of a modern bolo. Probably retired. MGA's mini verse, make it mini food Halloween series one, mini collectibles, all three. So these are those little surprise balls that you unbox and they have different things in them. And, you know, people try to collect all of them and they'll buy more balls just to try to get the one item that they're missing. And they end up spending a lot of money on these. But anyway, it says my bolo was bought. Um, a return box on whatnot for $35. And one of the items was this listed and posted and not even an hour, I get a sold notification. My fastest bolo shipped it on the same day. eBay store is Simple Dad Finds and my whatnot is Elfie's Treasures. So bought a return box on whatnot for 35 bucks. So I don't know how many items were in the box, but it looks like they sold this one item for $60. So that's fabulous. And these are uh, just probably something that you wouldn't expect to be worth it. So definitely if you're at garage sales, different places, you may find something like this. But Whatnot is a great place to source. If you're not sourcing on Whatnot, definitely, definitely consider it. Um, I do have a referral link down below where you can get $15 to shop if you join with that. And um, lots of referrals and affiliates down there that I use, not lots, but the ones that I use are down there in the description and check those out because those are things that I use for my reselling business. And most of them I have been using a long time and I am Bolo Buddies on whatnot and I've been selling a lot of stuff over there. So if you guys want to see how it works, definitely come and join. Um, use that referral link down below to get 15 to shop and you can get something to maybe resell. All right. And you don't have to use that with me. This one here says casino chips, vintage 290 total chips with MCM green turnit poker caddy. Found these at a garage sale for $10, turned it into a quick 375 plus shipping in less than two weeks. It was the chips that made it go for a great price. There they are. Oh, I like how they did the numbers. That is a good looking set. $375, $10 into 375. That's fabulous. This one comes from Farm Girl Scavenger Noel, and she has been really taking advantage of that photo room, uh, different backgrounds. <laughs> Look, you got a pancake or something here. <laughs> Twin Peaks RR Diner coffee mug, David Lynch, vintage 1950s chef's wear burgundy MCM. This is what it looks like. And she said, so much to share, and I'm so behind. Sorry. So here's another color of the same mug. See other posts. This one mug sold for $59.49. They were $75.12 all in shipped. Um, follow me on spots, Facebook, whatnot, YouTube, and eBay. And this one comes from Farm Girl Scavenger Noel, Farm Girl Scavengers on uh, eBay. She is a bolo finder. If you guys are not following her on Instagram, you got to go over there. She has the most nifty little... Um, posts that she puts on Instagram. They will help you learn. 
Fresh Start Concentrated Laundry Deterrent Detergent Powder 44 Load. You guys, seriously, you probably would have walked past this, right? I'm telling you, follow her on YouTube. She's got all kinds of tips. She um, has a lot of Bolo videos where she categorizes things and goes live. Check out um, the old shows. They are so educational. She said, okay, story time, because you know I have them, LOL. I got these this free, actually got two and already sold the other one. Sold it for $97.49 during a 25% off sale. They were all in for $116.52, all in shipped. This is a true bolo. Yes, it is. So keep your eyes peeled. So I got feedback from this person and it totally cracked me up. See the comment below for a good chuckle. So what they wrote was, um, the price is too expensive. <laughs> and I put, I would have to agree with him, but hey, a bolo is a bolo. I mean, if they want it, they're going to pay for it. They must really, really love this uh, fresh start. What is it? Is it? It's laundry detergent. Okay. This is also from Farm Girl Scavenger Noel. Royal Dalton, the British Bulldog Ceramics, white limited edition, 487 out of 1,000. She said, I guess I should read and post April sales. I need help most days to adult. <laughs> so this sale is from Large Royal Dalton purchase I made. Courtney showed in a previous video. I have $2.50 into this item, took a best offer of $280, shipped. They were all in for $328.86. Never pass up a good deal. It can pay back thousands over time. Here is another one. I had these mugs years ago and they wrap and they rapidly and consistently sold for $120. I found a bunch more about a year ago and paid $0.99 cents each. There is another seller who only sells items from the show Twin Peaks, and this is the second time they have bought me out. I made my money back from this purchase with the first mug I sold. I made them a deal and can't say I'm upset with making a deal with another seller. This way, they are no longer competing with me. This was a win for both of us. Sold 14 of these, my whole stock for 325, 384 shipped. Also sold to another buyer two days before this sale for 122.92 shipped. So you can see they sell well. Don't forget to follow me all places. Farm Girl Scavenger Noel. So these are more of those Twin Peaks RR Diner coffee mugs. I would not want to ship those. Wow. Okay. This one says, sorry, I have issues. Posted in the plush bolo, had to move around. Purchased a huge lot of these games at an estate sale a couple years ago and finally got them listed. Listed it high and took an offer for $170. They were all in for $208.74. The price was one of the highest for a used version of this game, but I took my time laying every piece out and taking good detailed pictures. This is key. Um, let's see. What is it? Axis and Allies Anniversary Edition game. $170. Now that's one I've never heard about. You guys got to follow Farm Girl Scavenger Noel. She is definitely a bolo finder. All right, this one, purchased at a church sale, rummage sale for $2, accepted an offer for $75, buyer left wonderful feedback. It's a vintage pine cone hill, fine linens, gypsy velvet, Euro pillow sham. It's a pillow sham, one single pillow sham, guys, $75. You might've missed it, right? This one is a vintage 47 Astros t-shirt with Astrodome patch, unisex, extra large. Bought this vintage t-shirt at a fundraising yard sale for 10 cents. It was at the bottom of a box. Sold on Poshmark for a best offer of 75. So down below, I was talking about uh, referrals and affiliates. I've also got uh, Poshmark and Mercari down there. If you guys aren't selling on those platforms, Poshmark, you can get $10 to shop. And when you join with my link, Mercari, you can get $10 to shop with my link when you join and another $20 to shop when you sell $100 worth of items. So uh, definitely branch out to other platforms, more eyes, different people. I had an item that was on Mercari for 90 free shipping. I had it on eBay for less. I had it on Poshmark for less, but I did not have it for free shipping on those platforms. But now on Mercari, you get to keep the full amount. So I got the entire $90. I don't know why they bought it on Mercari. Maybe they had a store credit, but it just goes to show you never know who's shopping where. I had it listed in all three places and it sold fastest on Mercari. So that happens a lot with plush. And I have a Build-A-Bear video where I talk about plush items that sell for more on Mercari than they do eBay. It's really weird, 
but they do. And uh, that's a Build-A-Bear video. So you can type in Build-A-Bear Bolo Buddies and you can check that out. And List Perfectly is what I use to cross post. I love it. I've been using it since 2019. If you're looking for a cross posting service, I have a tutorial down below. They have out the new Pro Plus plan that you can get for the price of Pro the Pro plan right now. And it's got a ton of new features. So check that out. Uh, link 30% off down. I'm sorry, the link below. You can use code Bolo Buddies to get 30% off your first month of List Perfectly if you want to try that. This one says, paid $25 at an antique mall that I have a booth at, sold on a seven-day auction, eBay starting at $299.99, which is where it sat until the last 30 minutes. The final selling price was $603 with free shipping and the buyer left amazing fees feedback. This is a sterling silver set. So yeah, if you can find sterling silver, I cannot believe she found sterling silver for $25. That is unreal right there. It's right, it's right there. And usually those antique malls, like people that are selling at those, they usually know what they're selling. That's incredible. What an incredible find. Speaking of a Build-A-Bear on Mercari, look at this. Build-A-Bear, my little pony, bought for $3.99 at Goodwill and sold it for $140 on Mercari. Yep. 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 There you go. This one is mine, and you may have seen this in my Big Money Bolo uh, video about items that I sold for big money personally. This is a vintage Laura Ashley dress. It's a prairie ruffled cottage dress, uh, size 10, and one of the buttons fell off when I was listing it. Yep, I just put that in right here in the info, and... I sold this for $227.50 and the buyer paid shipping. This was an international sale, so they did have international fees as well. So there you go. And this one here is also mine. You may have seen this in the video as well, but I wanted to share it here as well because sometimes people don't always watch my what sold videos, but they do watch these. I sold these vintage scratch and sniff. These are from the video. It's a YouTube video I did. I went into the Goodwill bins and I found a envelope full of scratch and sniff stickers. If you want to see how many and some of my other solds, check out I Will Make Thousands Goodwill Bins Bolo Buddies on YouTube. Sold this for $75, six stickers, $75 for six stickers. So for these two sets of stickers, the buyer was all in for $150. Scratch and sniff. If you find them, do not pass them up. Okay, look them up. Some go for more. They do not all go for big money. A lot of times sellers will take them and they will cut them and sell them individually. So um, keep that in mind as well. All right, you guys, thank you so much for being here. Go over to the Facebook group. Look for the best May bolo. Share your bolo there. I also have your best plush bolo up. So if you guys have a stuffed animal that sold for big money, share that on the other post. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Check out those uh, links down below. Those are referrals and affiliates that I use for my business. I appreciate it when you guys check those out. It helps me keep this channel going. Thanks for watching.